Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. It goes without saying anything. We're very excited to do more 21 Pilots. We want to say that the 21 Pilots fans who watch our reaction videos have always, always been so kind to us. I don't honestly, it it's not surprising considering Tyler and his message about mental health and being good that the fans are that way. And even if we may have gotten stuff wrong or said something that maybe people didn't agree with, there has never been a bad comment from the 21 Pilot fans. Like some fan groups, I won't say who, but there's some, even though we love some artists and we might, maybe we are sometimes critical of said artists that we might truly enjoy, but we'll have criticisms. 20, 21 Pilot fans have always been gracious. So I, I, I always want to give a shout out to the fans of certain artists that seem to have a really good fan base. So yeah. with that being said, uh, this is a live performance by Tyler Joseph. It's for the Storytellers session. So it's just him. The song is called Ride. It's a patron request uh, from Corporate Goth. She's our favorite goth, and, her, and the best kind of goth is a corporate goth. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, we've already done a live performance of this song, but we have obviously not done this live performance. And it's, again, it's just Tyler. All right. Yeah. Excellent. Well, let's get into it. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Thanks for coming, guys. Um, so, I've done a few of these where I play the, these songs on just the piano, but this time I brought a few extra toys to oh, trigger yeah, some loops that, yeah. and some samples oh, yeah. and stuff. Sweet. So, got a few songs I think I've... So, that, that's what mm -hmm. Corporate Goth told us that we did. I forget the name of the song, sorry, Titles Escape Me, but we did one of the songs from the set. I think it was like the third yeah. or fourth song. Yeah, okay. I'm okay. going to do three songs that has kind of a new... Um, reimagined version of them, and then a couple okay. just me and the piano as well. Um, so cool. bear with me; I, I've got a lot to figure out, but hopefully, it's going to come a horn off correctly. Uh, maybe. <laughs> oh no, he's got headphones. Okay, I thought he picked up so a horn, can... like a little. <laughs> no, knowing him, he could probably play the horn too with his feet or something. <laughs> <laughs> the guy can do everything; it's crazy. All right, let's start with this first one. Is that the looping machine there? He's got a pre-recorded yeah. beat. Oh, see, he was recording it when he did that, and then yeah. let go. It's crazy. Now he's changing the yeah, changing the pitch or whatever. Yeah, modulation. Crazy. You would love to have this thing, Nathan. Knowing you, you would yeah. love to have this. Yeah. It's hard sometimes Pieces of peace in the sun's peace of mind I know it's hard sometimes Yeah, I think about the end just way too much But it's fun to fantasize All my enemies wouldn't wish who I was But it's fun to fantasize Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm falling so Taking my time on my ride. Yeah, we've heard this song for sure. Yeah. I'm falling so I'm taking my time on my ride. Oh, 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 oh. Taking my time on my ride. Oh, 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 oh. I die for you. That's easy to say. We have a list of people that we would take. A bullet for them, bullet for you. Bullet for everybody in this room, but it don't seem to see many bullets coming through. 
See many bullets coming through metaphorically I'm the man, literally I don't know what I do I live for you and that's hard to do Even harder to say when you know it's not true Even harder to write when you know that tonight People back home are try talking to you But then you ignore them still All these questions there for real Like who would you live for? Who would you die for? And would you ever kill? the same mics we have. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Back in Canada, but yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. I hope we didn't stop it early. Usually, Corporate Goth is with us live. Okay, if we stopped it early, we're sorry. Yeah, we're sorry. They did. A, <laughs> they did. They did applause, and he stopped it, and he applaud, and the applause came. So I'm, I'm hoping that was the right time to stop it. We'll, we'll start. Okay, so the applause for the next one. Yeah, yeah, we'll explain. It. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Nathan, that was an amazing, amazing performance. I mean, of course, we were exclaiming such throughout the video and throughout the song. Mm. I should say mm-hmm. we were. Ooh, ha, ha, that's crazy! But I, mean, I couldn't help it. I just, I, I'm, I'm legitimately um, flabbergasted and fascinated by anyone that has that timing ability—not just the talent to sing, but it's all this—the math you're doing, the the musical math you're doing. Okay, I'm making this vocal, you know, you're singing it mm-hmm. properly on key. Unlike me, you're singing it into the mic, and then you know when to stop that recording, and then you know when to put the drum track overlay in. Then you know when to start singing on the piano while you're playing the piano with that part playing the back. I was like, Oh, I would be like, if that was me on there, it'd be, you, you could give me a hundred years to perform that song. I probably would never get it. Honestly, I don't know yeah. how they do it. So you have to practice um, it. That's the problem. Is that what it is? Is it practice? Yeah. You have to practice oh. a lot. You have to go. Oh. I, I've told my story before of me screwing this up. So I yeah, that was a, I love that like, story. I forget which video it was. It was probably on the one that we did with the same venue. It was hilarious. One of the funniest stories ever told. Uh, but yeah, amazing song, amazing reconstruct, a beautiful song. Thank you so much, uh, Corporal Goth, for that. I, I loved his singing, of course. The, the just the overlays of all the stuff he was doing. And Nathan, I'm sure you have some comments about the machine he was using. Uh, I think you would like to have one, would you not? Oh yeah, no, I and I've had one before. Obviously, I've had something oh, okay. like it, not the same. It's just okay. a looping pedal. It wasn't really a. Right. He's got something where it's got. He's got a few pre-programmed sounds, and he's got mm-hmm. the ability course, to loop. Yeah. What's cool is is if you notice, he'll press a button, and then it joins him in the the mm. beat of the of what he's singing. So it's like instead of having to press it right when you want it, it's kind of like keeping a, a timing somehow. That's I think that's why he's got oh, the wow. headphones on. I think the headphones oh. are giving him the beat. So it's like on the fourth beat, he you know, it comes in. So he presses it in advance and then it comes in on that beat, which that's fascinating because that's that's not what you would need. You wouldn't be able to like do it at the exact quarter note of the timing and hit the th- that would be much harder to try and get perfectly and it would sound weird. So anyway. Mm. I loved that. I loved everything about that. My my uh, m- my experience with that made me go. People that that criticize this stuff because I know there's people who maybe they they what? don't like listening to us talk about bands that have you know that are pop bands whatever they they kind of like you know what I mean we've had some some our critics for us when we sure. started doing things like you know One Direction or um, mm. Taylor Swift whatever. Fine, I understand why you feel that way about those bands, but I don't think you can say that about uh, this band. 
these mm. guys are exponentially talented. To, to be able mm -hmm. to pull off what he just did there is a true mm -hmm. sign of a great musician, I think. Just to be able to show that oh. you can uh, pre-plan the song to that degree and have all your music ready to go and you just, you, you adapt. He's got a little bit of a, a rap style that he does with his, with his, you know, his singing, his vocals are fantastic. All the past, he's got everything. He's got everything you need to be a great musician and, and so mm -hmm. well-rounded that, yeah, I'm like, like Christina's mesmerized. Yeah. I'm mesmerized too by watching this. Me too. I, I love it. Yeah. Oh, I know. I know you are. I'm, I'm very, I'm very happy that we get to do this this way. Cause mm -hmm. I think you, you reached out a little while back and said, I think I want to do 21 pilots, um, on your own. Me? I remember that. That was you. Oh, yeah. and, and you asked me if I wanted to do 21 pilots. And I said, yeah, sure. I don't mind. And okay. it's been a great, it's been a great roll of the dice because it's paid mm -hmm. off long-term for us in terms of music that we really enjoy stuff that yeah. we've used, added to our phones. Yeah. I, it's the, it's a great band. So I know I'm a little bit long winded here, but I, I, I really felt, felt great with this one and I, I enjoyed it. So thanks corporate goth. I'm glad you're long winded. I love hearing what you have to say. Oh, yeah, well, cheers. Thank you. It's good. Thank you. All right. Well, that's, yeah. that's you. Yeah. Is that me now? Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's I'm good. good. We're good. <laughs> okay. Thanks, everyone. We enjoyed it. And uh, check out all our other 21 pilots. It's all there. There's lots of it. Check it out. See you in the next one.